How are you doing guys? You're very welcome to another edition of Tom Fly Fishing. Today I'm going to be urinating for sea trout and I'm really excited to get out on the river and catch a few, especially on the urinimps. It's a very effective way of catching them um, over the traditional wet fly, you know, fishing at night or whatever, or fishing with worms. Urinating for sea trout during the day is very, very effective and um, I can't wait to get started. I have a lot of wee rivers in my region here. There's about five to choose from, so I'm gonna go around them all maybe and um, see what we can get out. So I'm really looking forward to it. The equipment I'm gonna use today, I'm not using heavy equipment. It's just um, a 10 foot 2 weight, the tone lucid. And the flies I'm using are going to be just, they're not, they're not even big flies. So I'm just gonna adjust the weights according to the flows and the depths and things like that there. So I'm gonna start off, it's not too deep here. Um, with a two and a half mil silver bead and also a two and a half mil silver bead now i have a 14 and a 16 on and the flies that i'm using are flashy the sea trout like the the flashy nymphs over the sort of dark and more traditional kind of nymphs you know um and that's that's i suppose that's what i've been getting them on lately so i'm going to give these a whirl and uh see what happens so hopefully yeah we'll get a few sea trout let's go and see what we can get all right, so I'm just going to start here. There's a lovely pool. I'm just going to pick out the pools. The, the trout at the minute, they're not really in the running water, not unless they're at the very top of the, the run. So the lovely light here, the flow is just coming in, sitting off the bank, and I have to be careful there's a snag in there, but I'm just going to stay left of the flow here and see what happens. It's going to be actually going to be very tight in here. I'm just going to tuck myself in a bit, give myself a bit of casting space. And see what happens. My goodness. Oh, first cast. Sea trout and a brown trout. There you go. Nothing wrong with that at all. The brown trout got off and the sea trout stayed. That wasn't bad at all. I didn't expect that. First cast. Let me see. Unbelievable. Lovely, lovely little sea trout. Hopefully there's a few more in there. We let them go. It's amazing. A bit further up the pool. Nice and handy. Another sea trout. Come back. Oh, lovely jubbly. Oh, this is a good sport. First pool and two sea trout so far. Took the, the point fly. Lovely, lovely sea trout. They're all nearly the same size. No sea lice on them, but he sees okay. Lovely fish. Just gonna see if I can get another one. Back in again. Oh, I've got a, a take there, but I'm not sure what it was, so I'll just throw it up. Only brandy this time. There we go. Let's just get the flies up a wee bit further. Only up another meter or two. Lovely wee Bernie. So oh. Okay, so just moving up the river a bit more. <clears throat> what we have here. It's not really a pool as such, but flow's running heavy on the far side. And there's always a few fish lying about here. Those brown trout, that is. But I'm just hoping there'll be a sea trout in among them. So I'm just going to start off. It's, it's very, very tight in here. So I took myself right into the edge here. I just let the line go downstream and load the rod off the, the flow of the river. And that should get them up into where I want them. So.
This is really close quarter stuff. And what I'm doing here, I'm just going to work my way slowly, slowly up into this run here and see what we can get out of it. Small brownie. Best thing to do here when you're playing fish, just get on your hunkers and lower the rod handle down to the surface so you, you don't beat the tip of your rod in the trees. This could be a secret. It feels heavy, so yeah. I would say it's a secret. I don't know, it's a very good brownie. There you go, sea trout. And it wasn't a brownie. We'll be flaking out, nice and convenient. Unbelievable fun, right in the trees. See you later. <laughs> You're walking way over to the wall. Hopefully, there's no snags up there. Nice brownie. Not a bad wee one. Then stream with the line. Make sure you're clear. Put that right up there. Oh, there you go. In the tree. Ah, see what happens when you're fishing in tight places. I just hooked that tree. <laughs> I actually thought the sea trout was going to go into that log there, but he went mad. Look, there might be another one in there. We'll just give it another go. It is tight in here. The wee brownie just took me there. Oh, there you go. Another sea trout. Wonder was that the same fella? Oh, geez. these guys are very acrobatic. Get into the net. Am I having some good fun here with these? Unbelievable, and they're fairly fresh, like. It's going to keep fishing. Seems to be a few in here. Oh, two brownies. I think they'll gain the ends of brownie. Yeah, he is. What do you do? All right, so the small has gone. That's a nice brownie, especially for this river. Unbelievable. I'm on a different river, and um, I'm just in a location here that always sort of give me a bit of sport in the past, so I'm going to see if I can get a few sea trout out of it. Oh, Jesus, man, that's a nice fish here.
My goodness. This is a brownie. By the look of it. Whoa! What a brownie, boy. Holy goodness. That is a cracking brownie for this river. What a fish. Oh, there we go. Lovely stuff. Oh, ah, oh. lost him. Well, right, look, at least I know they're there. Hey, Sean. Not sure what he is. Feels like no. What way you hook a trout? You can have him sideways. But I actually think this guy could be a sea trout. No. It is a brownie. Not bad. Not bad all the same. Hopefully. Hopefully now we might get a sea trout next. He's not bad. Oh, now that's a, that's a good take there. I actually think this one's a sea trout. Might not one anyway. Yeah, sea trout. Just going to take him handy. Not like the last guy I lost. There we go. Into the net, boy. Cracking, cracking sea trout. Hell of a trout. He's all wrapped up. Well, folks, I think on that note, I'm uh, going to call it a day. And I'm going to get this guy sorted and get him back. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. That's sea trout on Euronymphs. And hopefully I might have more sea trout Euronymphs videos in the future. So. Tight lines. Thanks for watching and good luck. See you later.